With all of the negative headlines dominating the news these days, it can be difficult to spot signs of progress. What makes you optimistic about the future? Solar energy plus desalination plus gene therapy. Using gene therapy to build a human that can drink salt water and use sunlight like a plant? Yes, I await the day as well. All seven of my honeybee colonies are currently surviving the winter, and today they're bringing in the first pollen of the year. Edit. Also, please support native bees for why and how at home. Check out. Bringing nature home by Douglas Tall Amy, as well as asterisk butterflies like the monarch and bats. The good news is often quiet and subtle. The bad news is always loud. I try to remember that. Our headlines are splashed with crime yet for every criminal there are 10,000 honest, decent, kindly men. If it were not so, no child would live to grow up. Business could not go on from day to day. Decency is not news. It is buried in the obituaries, but is a force stronger than crime. The population is on the rise. If we could work together to save the bees, we can deal with climate change. I hope we can deal with climate change, but it is a much bigger problem than the bees, mostly because the bees aren't costing anyone billions of dollars. I mean, I haven't heard much about ISIS recently. That's gotta be a good sign. They no longer control anything meaningful anymore, they're just your garden variety terrorist group now. Advancements in health studies and science for health has improved living conditions tenfold and continue to do so. So that makes me pretty optimistic. Space. So much is unknown right now. Excited to see what can come in the future. Watched Falcon Heavy launch the other week and was amazed for the first time in a long time. Mental illness awareness is growing rapidly and people are more and more willing to assist those in need. There's still people like you that donates like half of their money every year or whatever dot firest bum. Holy shit I didn't realize Bill Gates was the OP until I saw your comment. As someone with mental health issues, I love that the field is getting more attention and there's becoming less of a stigma of having a mental illness. A relative of mine checked into a mental hospital yesterday for depression and bipolar disorder. The amount of support he received from friends and family was very encouraging. This is the most peaceful time in human history. And it is getting better. The better angels of our nature. And the fact a billionaire has a platform to communicate 1v1 with everyday people. Thank you Reddit. The better angels of our nature is the best book I've ever read. I've never had something completely change the way I view the world. It puts everything into perspective. The growing acceptance of people who are different. It might be a long slow battle, but we are moving in the right direction. Everyone is a weirdo, and I love weirdos. The constant technological advancement we're seeing right now, especially in fields like medicine. Your work. Giving away so much money is truly commendable, and I thank you for it. My Girl Scout troop. They bring me hope that the future generation gives a shit. And they also give us thin mints and Samoas. Whenever there's a grim news story, I always remember Mr. Rogers' mother's advice. I look for the helpers. It's a great reminder that people are inherently good and human ingenuity will get us where we need to go, eventually. I'm three months pregnant after the second round of IVF. The fact that my wife and I are going to have a baby together makes me ridiculously optimistic about our future. Marijuana legalization for the USA, which will reduce crime and non-violent offenders in prison, as well as a host of other widespread positive effects. Not to mention undercutting cartels. Realizing that Bill Gates is the OP, meaning we can have personal conversations with people who used to be outside our reach. The world is getting smaller. It's not that the world is getting smaller, our reach is just getting longer. I was born with a very rare muscle illness and am rooting very hard for a cure on a genetic level. That is why I participate in any study that is thrown my way by doctors. 
reading headlines on research going into human trials is very exciting and gives me great hope for the future. Working with people directly, I noticed a lot of them are good, generous, honest, and benevolent people. These people give me the drive I need to handle things because I know we can shape a better future for the people, animals, and the planet. Also puppy gifts. Several nations have pledged to move away from fossil fuels toward renewable alternatives. The fact that people like you actually use their considerable wealth, and therefore power, to try and help the world rather than destroy it for further profit. We are living in the golden age of astronomy right now, and it's only gonna get better every year from here on out with the emergence of giant telescopes and new fields like exoplanetology. Recently, a possible cure for cancer was created, eliminating all cancer in 100% of tested mice, and is about to move forwards into human trials. How intelligent our younger generation is shaping up to be. Whether it be the students protesting or figures like Malala and other children. I think our future is in safe hands.